This time is John Kane's Corner. Today we're gonna be unboxing Godzilla, Godzilla X Kong or Godzilla and Kong? I don't know how to read the title because it is an X, but I think it's you read it as Godzilla X Kong. Well, whatever. The new Empire, the new movie coming out on March. And there's a toy already before before the movie. So yeah, wow, that's kind of a bit of spoiler. So we have double pack Godzilla versus Shimo, the new Titan. And my first impression about this toy is wow, Shimo is big at the toy. Like look at the size. Well, it's still small figure, but still kind of big. So yeah, what a decent size of the toy. So here's the package. Here's the image of Godzilla. And then we have Shimo. Oh my god. She looks menacing. Oh, by the way, um, I, I need a bit know about this Titan. And from what I know, it's that she moves a girl this time. Well, since we don't have much female titan. And it's kind of big in the movie. She's gonna be big. I don't know about when four walked on four eggs. Maybe she's still big. But when she stands on t using two eggs... She's gonna be big than all the titans. I heard that she's gonna be big than King Ghidorah. So yeah. So I can't wait for the movie to come out. So here's the box already. Here's the description. And this is a diorama set. Which of course has crystals. And bone cage. It's kind of big figure. Ah, oh, big bone cage. So here's the back. On the side. Yeah, pretty much it. Here's the barcode. It's from Premates. It's focus. Alright, let's find unbox the toy. So I think this tape here. Ah, oh, okay, minute. There you go. This toy cost one thousand, one thousand eight hundred pesos. It's kind of expensive for two pack, but. From what I like from the double pack is the painting of the figure it looks a bit different from the the Soyo ones. This one has special paint, which I kind of like it. It's the box. Oh, not the back of the box. You get. Diorama. I think it's the instructions. Good thing this instruction. Hmm, not bad. It's the tail. Assembly. So yeah, I think I'm gonna do this later. Hopefully I can do that. But right now let's focus on the figure. And wow, look at that. I like it. It's the tail. The plastic. Look at the back well. Cool. Pink background. Alright, so. Oh, yeah, the cool thing is it has accessory for both Shimo and Godzilla. This is the top. 
Atomic Blast and Frost Bite Blast. Is that okay? Wait, let me look at the box. Frost Bite, Frost Bite Blast. So yeah. Let's get yeah, weird. I can do it. It's just the seesaw. Right. So we have Godzilla Atomic. Brass, it's kind of red. Oh yeah, the weird thing is, I don't know why Godzilla spine is kind of red, while in the movie it's it's pink. I don't know why. Well, I don't know. Maybe we'll see on in the movie. And here's Sh Shimo, Frost Bite, Brass, and they're kind of different. Well, I mean, which is cool. cool. Let's put that aside. And now, let's unbox. Let's take a look at the G Man first. So. Oh boy. So let's cut the. There you go. And then this one, the foot, I think. Yeah, this one. There you go. Do you have to tell? And we can do it inside the front. Let's put the gym on first. Hope it's fully free. Yeah. Wow. Oh man. Spine. Fix that. Man, I, I don't know why they did. Uh, good thing the spine is soft plastic. Oh boy, it's a bit bent. Well, it's okay, I guess. For the tail. Okay, so. Man. Godzilla evolved tail is kind of long. Yes, that way I said. So it's about the tail. Hope it's easy. <sighs> okay. Pretty easy. Cool, cool. I love it. And here's Godzilla. Ah, wow. Um. He's cool. Um, the paintings. I wish they do better because you got the eyes. It's kind of derpy. I wish they do better. And should they add paint here? They should put red and the tail. Hmm. It's, it's alright, I guess. Man, I love the red. Spine Man This 
this door so it's kind of bent right now so that's a shame on the box okay so I have the paint the double pack version yeah cool cool so the possibility the mouth moves up and down the neck surprisingly not move a bit well it can move a bit okay and arms can do this back and forth uh disappointingly no swivel like wow seriously even this arm no swivel as well even the eggs no swivel uh no spirit joint that's what you call so you can move up this far and down that far yeah it yucks uh possibility but i think it's for the best to ch for children to play yeah it's it's a toy so yeah then tails on ball joint so yeah you can do this yeah it's fully possible soft plastic cool now let's put them atomic rift so there's a hole in the mouth so I think you plug it like this Yeah, like that. Wow. I like it. I like the accessory. Push. Oh, the foot moves also. Wow. Swivels. Oh wait, that's 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 the swivel joint. Uh, I don't know. What do you call that joint? Spread? I don't know. Forgot that. But anyway, got Z done, and now Shimo time. Oh boy, there she is. Okay, so let's do at the back. Just a small tail, surprisingly. I think that's okay. Never mind. Guys. Oh my god, his Shimo. Pretty cool. Alright. I believe. <sighs> there you go. Got it done. Yeah. Holy crap. Okay. Wow, you got Shimo. She's my favorite kaiju now. Nice. 
Nice. Wow. Um. Yeah. Um. This figure is better than the normal one because on the soil. Um. The only color is just white and blue, just the main color, and it's not much of translucent. But this one is yes. But it's kind of fine for me. It's kind of fine. I love the shading effects. Ah, ice, light blue effect on Shimo, which is cool. And wow. Well, so it's a quick size comparison. Yeah. So she may be small on four egg, but if she's big, oh crap, she's huge. She's tall. Wow. Don't tell me in the movie she's big on two eggs. Can't wait for that. So yeah. So anyway. Possibility. So the mouth moves. Um, oddly wide. Like, wow. <laughs> it's kind of weird. So her head can up and down. It can swivel this time on the gods. But Sadi can't move side to side. On the up and down and swivel and her front legs or arm oh she can spread on like Godzilla which is strange her foot can rotate even this one I think on the back leg also yeah can do that Her back leg can go front this far. She can sit. That's cute. For back, go like that. Man, I can do this. A T pose. <laughs> Kung Fu. Seriously. But I like it. And the tail is. It's also ball joint, obviously, so you can rotate and side to side, up and down. Yeah, fully possible. So, yeah, I love this figure so much. And now, let's put it on her frostbite. So, just project that. Um, I think, yeah, there you go. She mill on with her frostbite blast, which is cool. Here's with Godzilla. Oosh, oosh. Yeah, you have the figure so far. Stand up. The Shimo stand up with. She's kinda tall. Wow. And alright. Um, yeah, I don't think I don't have time to do the. the diorama. Yeah, I don't have time for that, so I'm kinda sorry that I can't show you the diorama. But. Yeah, I don't have time for this. Um, yeah, kinda sorry viewers. So here's the yes. Peek of it. Yeah. Kinda sorry I can't show the diorama. I can't. I'm too hazy for it. Yeah, so I, it's mainly focused on the figures. So anyway, so I think that's it. I like it. So thanks for watching, subscribe for more videos like this, 
hit the notification bell to do that. And give a comment down below who's your favorite uh, kaiju in the new movie Godzilla X Kong The New Empire. Can't can't wait to watch that movie. So yeah, anyways, bye.